So using org mode, you can also perform some uh, calculations on your uh, on your tables if you want. And we learned how to create a table. We learned how to work uh, with tables in uh, one of the previous video. And today, what I want to do, I want I want to basically get started with uh, using org mode in Emacs to basically use org mode uh, as a spreadsheet program. I'm not really trying to compare it with Excel or Google Sheets or uh, other uh, native uh, full-fledged uh, spreadsheets, but I'm trying to show the capability of the tool where in case you want, you can also use org mode for uh, storing your information in a, in, a, in a tabular format, but at the same time, uh, you may want to calculate, uh, you, you may want to perform some calculations. So let us say you have a table where you are, let us say, keeping track of some important dates and uh, along with the important dates uh, and these important dates are like uh, end date or deadline whatever you want to call it so let us say you have this first column where you may want to have uh, dates like uh, let us say some date in january uh, like 26th of january which is the republic day of india and uh, uh, let me just uh, uh, type it here and let us say you want to calculate the days uh, left until this particular deadline or this end date. Now what you can do, you can actually access the tables uh, column by using a dollar. And if you uh, do something like dollar one, two, three, dollar one means the uh, first column, uh, or dollar two is second column and so on. So if you do something like this, dollar three is equal to one, two, three. And if you evaluate this by pressing control C, control C, you can see here that uh, we have uh, one, two, three filled in. Uh, this is all good, but we want to do something dynamic. So you can also do now, which is the current current uh, date. And uh, you can see here, if you evaluate Control C, Control C, you will see the current date filled in. So now we are uh, getting close to what we want to do. Now we can also replace it with uh, what we have in the first column, uh, like $1, for example. So you have the values copied, but we want to basically do something like $1, um, minus the um, dollar one of, of course is the end date which is in f in future minus now but for performing the calculations we have to convert it into date so you can do something like this and uh, you can uh, do the same thing for the first column and you can uh, basically enclose everything in uh, in parentheses and if you now evaluate this you will get uh, days left or days until uh, that end date. So for example, 31st of October this year is still 297 days from now. Uh, 31st October 200, 2022 is uh, not 200, is 661 days and uh, 26th January this month is uh, 18 days in future. So it is of course a very simple way to manage your data in uh, of course tables but at the same time you may want you may also want to you may also want to perform some basic calculations because uh, i guess uh, we need to in 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 case in those cases where you want some some dynamic uh, some something dynamic that you want to appear on the table and it, it is of course a typical example of using a spreadsheet where you want uh, to let us say add numbers or maybe you're keeping track of your expenses for example and in this case the example that i showed you i although we have the option to use uh, uh, to associate dates with task in uh, your in your uh, org mode uh, headers or any task but you can also do the same thing with tables where you have control on uh, modifying the data on the fly and also you can uh, see the calculations uh, performing and uh, making the uh, basically doing the work for you. Of course, again, we are not, not really trying to replace Excel or Google Sheets, but since we guys love working and working on Emacs and using org mode, of course, it makes sense for using Emacs org mode for doing as much as we can without relying on uh, traditional spreadsheets uh, and uh, those heavy programs. So that is all I wanted to talk about in this video. I hope you learned something new today and you also learned and you also enjoyed watching this video. <laughs>
थैंक यू वेरी मच